Finally, some relief for a whole lot of frustrated commuters in South Austin. One flyover has now opened at I-35 in Ben White. But any driver can tell you Austin still has a long way to go to fix the traffic problems here. The Texas Department of Transportation just released its updated list of the 100 most congested roads in the state. And guess what? Austin has an even dozen on the list. You might call them the dirty dozen. They include the usual suspects, I-35, North Lamar, Mopac, 360, 290, and 2222. KXAN's David Scott reports the list should come as no surprise. So what is the most congested roadway of Austin's dirty dozen? You guessed it, I-35 from 183 on down to Ben White. We waste almost 4 million man hours sitting in this congestion at a cost of $84 million. The second most congested road on Austin's dirty dozen list, Lamar from 6th up to 45th. We waste 660,000 hours a year sitting in traffic on this road. Downtown Austin may be growing vertically, but you just can't widen some of these roads. And so the traffic builds. Now known as the Counter Cafe, this diner's been serving grub for 55 years, and it's never seen traffic like this. Everybody who's on 6th and Lamar just wants to get past 6th and Lamar as fast as possible. Doesn't seem to be hurting business, though. Well, business is pretty good here. I'm not complaining. Third on the list, the dreaded Mopac, running from 183 to 290. On the state list of 100, it ranks 39th. Close behind, 360, South 1st and Lamar, 2222, 620, and South Mopac. As congested as it's getting, maybe Austin drivers are just stoically adjusting. What do you think of the traffic these days around town? It's not as bad as New York or L.A. What do you think of traffic in town? Uh, certain spots are pretty unbearable. Overall, it's not too bad. TxDOT is responsible for maintaining 80,000 miles of roads. We've got our dirty dozen, but we're not alone. Take heart, Austin. It could be worse. We could be living in Houston. They have five of the top ten most congested roadways in all of Texas, plus a pretty bad baseball team. David Scott, KXAN News.